Okay. Who put my calculator in Jello? Good one. But uh, seriously, guys, who did this? Seriously, guys. Who did this? I need to know who put my calculator in Jello, or I'm gonna lose my freaking mind! Did you forget something? What happened to you guys? Give it back. The gift basket. Give it back. What is this? It's real simple. If you don't appreciate what we do, then give us back our basket. Maybe you should leave. Yeah, maybe we should. Maybe we should leave. Come on, let's leave. But before we leave, my wet friend and I are gonna wait for our cabs on your nice couches. Can you call us a cab, please? I'm gonna, oh, sorry. Look, Look my clothes are so wet. wet. Nice leather. Oh, my shoes are so muddy. All right, here you go. Take it there. It's been opened. Yeah, it was mine. What's missing? The turtles. Where are the Summer turtles? Sausage. Where are the turtles? Come on, guys, get out of here. Where are the turtles? Where are they? Excuse me, I have an announcement to make. We seem to be missing a box of chocolate turtles with pecans, and we will not be leaving the premises until we obtain them. Hand over the turtles now. I ate them, okay? I ate the turtles. They're gone. We'll bill you. A little, but I just thought you should know. Mm -hmm. well, I think something a little fishy is going on. A little fishy? Yeah. I mean, I've been noticing them all day. I just think it might be. That little girl is a child. I don't want to see you sniffing around her anymore this afternoon. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Boy, have you lost your mind, because no, no, no. I'll help you. Sorry. Find it. What you looking for? Ain't nobody going to help you out there. Jesus can come through that door, and he's not going to help you if you don't stop sniffing after my child. OK. Stanley yelled at me today. That was one of the most frightening experiences of my life. And I have a mission to accomplish. Make sure this party gets rolling, and I will be back shortly. Hey, where are you going? You want me to come with? Oh. Just listen, I forgot to tell you the plan for this Saturday. You, me, bar, beers, buzzed, wings, shots, drunk, waitresses, hot, football, Cornell Hofstra, slaughter. Then quick nap at my place and we hit the tin sound. No. I don't want to do any of that. Duh. Which is why I was joking about doing no, it. Just stop. Stop. Just stop doing it. You're going to drive me crazy. Fine, I'll just go sit at my desk and be quiet. Sorry I annoyed you with my friendship. Excuse me. And I'm also sorry that a lot of people here, for some reason, think it's funny to steal someone's personal property and hide it from them. Here's a little news flash. It's not funny. In fact, it's pretty freaking unfunny. That was an overreaction. <laughs> Gonna hit the break room. Does anybody want anything? Ma'am, you good? Yeah. Sure, okay. I made a mess. I forced Dwight to resign prematurely and I replaced him with Andy, who loves this place so much he punched a hole in it. It's a mess, a big mess. So do you want to see it or not? I don't know. I like, probably like crowds. Oh my God, you're like agoraphobic. Agoraphobic? Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you would rather sit on your couch and watch a Phillies game than go out to a movie with your awesome girlfriend. Absolutely correct. <laughs> Later, Jim. Kev, have a good weekend. Yeah. Bye. Okay, so this is what's gonna happen. You're gonna suck it up. Here we go. And we're gonna go to dinner. Okay. And then we're gonna go to the movies. Sounds good. Hey, help her! Hey. Right! Ah! Right! Ah! 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 <coughs> Pam, please call security.
every day for eight years, I have brought pepper spray into this office to protect myself and my fellow employees. And every day for eight years, people have laughed at me. Well, who's laughing now? Luke is going to use his laser pointer to point to account setup. You click on that first, then a whole new not, no, 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 Luke, come on, come on. Not on really? Oscar's head. All right, Luke, Michael. come on, stop it. What? I'm stopping it. That's what you said. Give me the pointer. So you just want me to move it. It's, you're being totally unclear here. I'm just going to go ahead and move it. No, just power it down. No, 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 no. Not on Angela's boob. Come on. Come on. Luke, seriously. All right, fine, fine. I'll just go. Okay. I'm going. All right. Okay. Good job. Okay, email accounts. So we're starting with account setup. Oh, my God. Is it in my eyeball? Yes. yes. I think he's burning my eye. Michael, do something. Sack up. You have to stop that. Luke, can I have that? No. Okay. I am going to count down from five. Five, four, four I'm not kidding. Three, three two, two, one. one. Give, okay. All right, here we go. What do you do? are going to learn to be more professional, Luke. That's what you're going to do, Luke. What the hell was that? I had to do that. You <sighs> this. Screw it. All right, are we good? <laughs> So how are we going to energize our office? I mean, I haven't done anything since Christmas. Pam clearly has just given up trying. So what we need to do is we need to get things going. We need to get percolating a little bit. Anybody have any ideas what we could do? Any suggestions? Yes, Andy. What if we changed our outgoing answering machine message so it just had a little more zing and a little more pep? Zing and pep. See, that's, those are the kind of words we're looking for. Yes, Jim. What about if we did an even newer voicemail message that had even more zing and pep? Now we're cooking. I like this. Maybe a whole theme, like a rap, a rap rhyme. An urban thing. An urban, yeah. Stanley, you want to help us out with that? Stanley, Earth is Stanley. Not me. Yes, you. Come on, Stanley. Put your little game down and, and join the group. No. Stanley, we're do having a little Leave brain me alone, damn we're it. having a brainstorm session. Did I stutter? Good, this is good. I'm going to grab a glass of water. Dad, don't think of it as a demotion, just think of it as a promotion to a lower level. I don't think you have to tell your friends anything. It hasn't been decided yet. Aaron, on phone memos, you're writing the date American style, month, day, year. I prefer it day, month, year. Small, bigger, biggest. Oh, sexual innuendo, not intentional. Shut up, shut up. Liar. Sexual innuendo, not intentional. I am sick of your dumb opinions. And if you don't like the way that I take phone messages, here, take them yourself. Our sex life is none of anyone's business. And Andy is the manager, not Nellie. Stop protecting me. I'm a man. I can protect myself. This is misdirected anger, and I'm sorry. I don't mean to lash out at you. There's a lot coming up right now, all at once. Dad, go to hell. I'm taller than you. Okay, just calm down. You are not the manager. I earned that job. I was personally chosen after Robert was chosen and quit. Andy, why don't you just take a seat? Why don't you take a seat, idiot? Why don't you jiggle your stupid memos and your stupid pens and your dumb caramels? And your stupid face! And your stupid office! Ah! He does not like that wall. What are you sorry for? So many things. I don't know. It's hard to choose. How about for dating my mom? Maybe that's. And it. dumping her on her birthday? Yeah. Yes. <sighs> okay, just. Don't ever date a member of my family. Again. Okay, I promise. For the record, your mom came on to me. <gasps> Holy crap. Are you okay? No. You're okay. <laughs>